Hey guys, what's up? So this week the video is about things I don't get and I did a video similar to this over summer and it was like things that don't make sense. This is like the same type of thing, I just worded it differently. So the first thing I don't get is when people get complimented like on their appearance or on anything, like their outfit, they don't say thank you. I don't know, I'm like, oh you look so pretty and they're like, like they just look at me like I'm weird and I'm like, oh my god, I just gave you a compliment and you're not even gonna take it. Like I take it back, I honestly take it back. I also see it on Instagram and Instagram comments, like people get Instagram comments like, oh my god, you look so good and stuff like that and they never respond and I'm like, what? It just makes me so mad because like, I don't know if it's just me, but whenever someone compliments me on anything, I always say thank you. There are some people that don't say thank you ever. The other day, there was someone who sneezed and I said bless you and they didn't say thank you. And I was like, okay, whatever, just gonna let that one pass. And that same day, someone else sneezed, like another person sneezed, and I said bless you. And again, I didn't get a thank you. And it's not like I whispered it, I yelled it and they still don't say anything and like whenever that happens I'm like you're welcome the second thing I do not understand is why we have to learn some things at school like I get like why we learn English because we speak the language the thing I really don't get is why we have to learn some complex math that we'll never use in our daily lives like I get math is all around us like square roots and exponents and factoring and like all that like why learning math for like being a math teacher when you grow up or having a math occupation but if you're not going to do anything related to math especially like crazy hard math why do we have to know so much about it and take tests and get graded on it i feel like school should prepare you to pay bills important things that you're actually going to need to know another thing that doesn't make sense and it kind of actually annoys me also okay so there's like the smart kid and like let's just say they're like oh my god i did so bad on that test and then i'm like oh what'd you get I feel like I got a hundred. What? And you're like, oh, I got an A. I got a 50. What are you talking about? A lot of people would actually like to be in your place, but no, you're like, oh, I did so bad. I got a like A. I got a 99. Like, what are you saying? Another thing I do not understand is when literally two year olds get iPhones, why do you need? an iPhone, like what are you gonna do on it? Play the Club Penguin app? Especially when they have a better phone than you and you're like 10 years older than them. Just would love to hear like one good reason why a two year old needs an iPhone. And the last thing that I don't understand is the beach. So when you go in the water and you get out of the water, you step on the sand and then you get sand stuck to your feet. Oh yeah, you're having so much fun in the water and then you get out and you have like sand all over you Okay, and also when you make a sand castle Like you don't want to sit down on the sand because you'll get sand in your butt crack when I was seven. I was at the beach and I sat down and I got sand in my butt and um You know, it wasn't a pleasant experience. I had to pick it out myself and then the rest of the day it was itching Let's say it's a windy day and someone just wants to go like this with their towel Sand gets everywhere. Someone did that next to me and they went like this and like sand got in my eye. Like I scratched my cornea, probably have permanent eye damage. There are like seagulls everywhere that attack you. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you guys liked it and I will see you.